In this video, let's see a question in your NCERT books. Now it says, if a pair of dice is thrown, x denotes the sum of numbers on them. So x is the sum of numbers on them. Find the probability distribution and expectation of x. So let me write solution and let me make clear how to do these kind of questions. So expectation is mean of a discrete random variable that we are talking about and probability distribution we have already studied in the previous videos. So it is saying that a pair of dice is thrown and we have to see about the sum of numbers which can appear on the dice. So either the sum of number can be 2 because 1 and 1 on both the dice will lead to 2 or 3 or 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12. Why? Because the maximum is 6, 6 on the both pair of dice. And what is the probability? So if this is your x, this should be your p of x. So the probability of getting a, a 2 on a 1, 1 on both the dice or 2 as the sum would be 1 over 36. Getting 3 would be 2 over 36 because there are two cases. 1 on the first die, 2 on the second or vice versa. Similarly here it would be 3 over 36. You can calculate on your own this is 4 over 36, 5 over 36, 6 over 36. Then again this will be in the reverse order. This some people have already learnt. You can calculate on your own and just write the values. And this over 36 all over the cases. Now these are all different cases. This is the probability distribution and this is the answer to the first part of the question. But not only this, we were asked to find the expectation that is mathematical expectation or the mean. So the mean or the mathematical expectation can be calculated as this multiplied by this. That means P1 X1 plus P2 X2 plus P3 X3 and so on till P12 X12. So what to do? This will be 2 multiplied by 1 over 36 plus 3 multiplied by 2 over 36, this is multiply, right, plus 4 multiplied by 3 over 36, plus 5 multiplied by 4 over 36, plus 6 multiplied by 5 over 36, and so on, you have to write this till 12 multiplied by 1 over 36. And now what you do, you just simply multiply and divide by 36, that means 3 by 36, plus 6 by 36, plus 12 by 36, plus 20 by 36, plus 30 by 36 and so on. So what will be the answer like? It will be 252 by 36. The numerators will add up to 252, the denominator will have the LCM as 36. Now 36 ones are 36 sevens are, so the expectation would be 7 or the mean would be 7. So this is how you have to do this kind of a question.